Hi everybody and welcome to room 61111 which is a Skyview Tower Suite, uh, King Suite in Mandalay Bay. We'll just quickly show you around. So this room was comped through MGM Rewards for four nights. Uh, four nights with 100 in free play and 100 in food and beverage credit. Um, probably the nicest room I've had from MGM. Really, really happy with it. So um, it's broken down into kind of three areas. So coming in in the main lobby here, you've got some nice kind of artwork on the wall. This is a nice kind of tiled floor with like a rug area in the middle over there. To your right here is your little kitchen, wet bar area. Um, just next to it is a half bath. So that's toilet. And then you've got a nice marble top sink. Empty cupboard down there. Put your mirror on the wall. Really nice. Okay. As we come out here, this is your wet bar area, as I say. Loads of cupboard storage in here. Um, charge of items. Obviously, um, all set to trigger if you move them. So being very careful while they're moving around the kitchen not to knock them. Um, in here you've got your mini bar. Again, all chargeable. Uh, one thing I would say is this is really hot. Uh, and it has got like a burning smell, which is quite concerning. Uh, I'm sure it's absolutely fine. Uh, excuse all my junk over here that I dumped. I've been buying stuff to take home with me. Um, so, you know, ice bucket, glasses, coffee maker. Uh, but the coffee maker works with these things over here. So, um, it's coffee, sugar, creamer, um, two kits inside each one of these cups. Um, and then above here, you've got a nice TV. I'd say that's about 42 maybe 36 or 42 inch um, and then what we all over a uh, hotel room we've got our own fridge for our own stuff currently fully loaded so last night I uh, I got room service to use some of my resort credit <laughs> hence the bag um, so there was a bit of an issue checking in so they give me an extra hundred dollars on top of the hundred I already had so um, Last night I thought I'd, uh, I'd treat myself. Now I've got chicken tenders, not realising they came with fries and kind of salad. Um, and then I got what I said was a quarter pizza, which turned out to be like a whole box pizza and cookies, which was a huge big box of three cookies. Um, so the pizza never got touched, the cookies never got touched, and one of the beers I ordered at the same time was left in the fridge. Now that came to about $78 without gratuity. Um, so, you know, quite expensive. I probably wouldn't pay it if I wasn't getting it on the uh, the resort credit. Um, but yeah, here we are. You see, enjoy the room. Obviously, nothing to do with that. Excuse my empty bottle on the side there. Lovely couch area, long, long couch. Do a lot of walking. So, this uh, footstool has become really useful for me. Nice table. A couple of nice lamps. And then we've got a couple of chips right in front of the window another little table and then we have the TV underneath let's you well there's a Harman Kardon uh, soundbar and then underneath all your little uh, network cables things like that uh, for connecting things to the TV and also a couple of sockets there which are great for charging your phone whatever you want to do uh, what I'll do I'll just hit the shears Okay, so excuse the sun, it's that time of day, so put you up on here you'll see brilliant view over to Delano, then we've got the car and garage, there's the Legion Stadium, down there you can just about maybe make out the Michelob um, Ultralist Arena, which is where Las Vegas Aces play, I believe. You know, you can see we're up on the 61st floor, one above, uh, what's like one from the top. So, really great view. 
mountains in the distance, the sun obviously, and just kind of looking that way, you've got the Luxor, and I think if you look a bit further up, if I'm not mistaken, you can see a bit of T-Mobile, um, palms in the distance there, um, and yeah, it's not a bad a little bit of area, I think, maybe city centre, um, and then you can kind of see a little bit of the pool. Uh, Take you down to the bedroom. Okay, so amazing big king bed, super comfortable. Comfortable as anything. Probably, I would say, the most comfortable bed I've stayed in um, in a hotel. Genuinely, really, really nice. Um, even beats the Premier in Hypnos beds, which generally are my favourites. Um, obviously, you got your phone, notepad, pen, which I'll be taking with me. Um, drawers. I've not even looked in these drawers. Have you got a Bible or nothing? Okay. Kind of seating area at the end of the bed for putting your shoes on, whatever you want to do. And we've got a lovely big TV here, probably about I'd say 42 inch, maybe maybe 56. Again, soundbar attachments underneath. Nice chest of drawers, loads of space in there. Excuse my trainers on the floor there. Um, then we've got a desk, nice lamp, chair, little table, and again, chest of drawers, TV, uh, uh, a rope there for the telly. Got your clock here, a couple of different settings on it, I've not messed with any of these. Um, looks like you can plug a few things into it. And again, views almost identical. Alright, as we bring it around, got some cupboard space over here. Again, you'll have to excuse, I've popped some stuff in there. There's your safe, loads of hangers. There's your luggage uh, rack thing, iron board, iron, pair of trainer socks up there that somebody left. Um, and then similar in this one, tons of space, robes, what have we got, MGM Resorts, don't feel the softest I'll be dead honest, I've had much nicer ones in like Hilton Hotel, like that, big, mirror there, almost floor to ceiling I'd say, not far off, definitely see all of yourself in it, right. Use my shadow, I'll put the lights on in here. Again, as we're in the room, some of my items are in here, so please disregard them. So there we have, nice big mirror, lit. There is a TV in the mirror as well. The remote control is there. Hair dryer, loads of toiletry products. Oh, there's like five bars of soap in here. In fact, I was using a bar of soap in the bathroom, it looks like they threw it away and they give me a brand new one, which is lovely of them. Um, double vanity, obviously. Then nice shower there with a rainfall head. Some artwork over there, and this for me has been the uh, the nicest thing. So I love the hot tub bath. I've uh, been here. This is my third night, and I've used it the first two nights, and I probably will use it later on. Sitting in here with a beer. Oh, it can't get any better, especially when your legs are aching from all the walking around the strip. Um, and then, last little thing to show you. Again, bathroom. So, if there's two of you, a couple, you can have a little bathroom each for your little private bathroom time. Um, or toilet, I don't know why I'm all of American all of a sudden. Um, but yeah, no, this, is, this is a really, really nice room. So yeah, I hope you've all enjoyed this room tour. I'll see you in the next one.